meanings. But what the church means is from Latin, minus stare, being small at the service of the people. That is the big difference between the ministers in the government and the minister of God. You are then minister of the word. The word of Jesus Christ. That is the powerful word. We made miracles. We should live, brothers and sisters, as a family. That is uh, the church. Family of God. I do not like conflict between chiefs and priests and bishops. There is no room for that. We are brothers and we know each other. As I know myself, my people in Ghana, don't make mistakes. The Nusra Jistam is an African. He knows his brothers and sisters. Like a good shepherd, they know also my voice. The Apostolic Nuncio examined the candidate. Reverend Prince Osu promised obedience to his superiors. Do you promise respect and obedience to your ordinary? I do. His Excellency invited the congregation to join in prayers. Reverend Prince Osu prostrates himself. This signifies humility and readiness to serve as the litany of the saints were sunk. Apostle Knisio and the priest present lay their hands on the candidate. This is an ancient tradition signifying transmission of power, life and divine force. This is done in silence. The Apostle Knisio to Ghana, Most Reverend Leon Kalenga, said the prayer of consecration. The newly ordained priest, Reverend Father Prince Hosu, is vest with stole and chasuble. His Excellency, most Reverend Leo Badikabele Kalinga anoint the palms of Reverend Father Prince Hosu. The parent of the newly ordained priest presented bread on a pattern and chalice containing wine and water to the celebrant. He then presents it to the newly ordained priest, Most Reverend Kalinga, together with Bishop Efrifa Ejekum, and the priest congratulates Reverend Father Prince Hosu with kiss of peace. <laughs> Reverend Father Prince Osu prayed and blessed the following people. Most Reverend Leon Kalenga and Most Reverend Joseph Efrifa Ejekum, Monsignors and Vocation Directors, his parents and government officials. So I have here with me Monsignor Paul Lawe, the parish priest of St. Michael's Catholic Church at Duadri in Koko. Monsignor, welcome to Catholic Digest. Thank you. Monsignor, what does the visit of the Apostolic Nuncio mean to this parish? The visit of the Nuncio means a lot to this parish. It means that there's a connection between this parish, this diocese, and therefore Vatican. Because the Nuncio is the um, Pope's ambassador to Ghana. And uh, for the past 22 years, I've never been in any ordination at St. Michael's Parish in Koko here. So his visit has brought us ordination, 